guys and welcome to a new video. We just watched the Oscars and now we're gonna react to episode 9 of The Last of Us. Look for the light. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, it's very, very late. It's even later as the later time. Oh, that was almost a Chewbacca. <laughs> oh, <damn. laughs> Okay, so Igor, you were here for the first episode, now you're here for the last episode. Welcome back to the show. Um, what... To the show? Ooh, this is the greatest show, we light in the fiddle. I, I really like uh, this series, it's very truthful to the uh, source material, so to, to the game. Uh, but they do still change a few things. For the better, I think. Yeah, like some things they just delete from the games, like the, the part with Bill, uh, yeah. and then then they make the episode with, uh, with they made the episode with Bill and Frank. Uh, I didn't think it was in poor taste because I I was I was invested this time. I, most of the time when things like this happen in movies, I don't like it because it's forced. But I did not have that feeling in episode yeah, 3, so good. that wasn't really a problem for me. And yeah, in all the other episodes the things that were changed was because yeah, the series isn't a video game, so a lot of sections, yeah, they disappear if you make a series of them and yeah, I, 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 it was great. I, the only thing I, I, I miss is a lot of the enemies, I, I want to see more clickers and I want to see more bloaters, but it's yes. normal. It's not a video game, so you don't see them as much. But that's the only thing I, I think is a bit sad. I would have loved to see yeah. more I wanted bloaters. to ask you about that, because one of the main problems a lot of people with the series have, apart from being woke sometimes, <laughs> is the fact that, well, there are not a lot of clickers and there are not a lot of infected showing. And a lot of people have said that because of that, the sense of danger is not really present or of why this world is so dangerous. Yeah, but that's the thing though. I, I have been thinking about this. Why haven't they uh, brought more of the zombies or of the corpus infected. Uh, infected into the series? But then I realized the, the, also the Last of Us game, yeah, those zombies were there, but they weren't really that big of a part of the story. It was always... The, people. The Last of Us was always a story about the people that survive after an outbreak with the zombies or with the cordyceps and it was always between the people the, because yes. not only the zombies, you didn't, don't, no, you didn't only have to face the zombies, you, you also faced a lot of people in the game and uh, the big conflicts al al always were with the people, with those people yeah. in um, what was the city Kansas. Uh, with the people uh, from the Fireflies, uh, with the people in, in Boston in the beginning even. It's always been between Joel, Ellie and the rest of, of, the, of the human civilization. The infected yes. were there, they were scary and they were very, um, how shall I say, uh, handy for the gameplay for a video game. But they are not as needed in the series as they were in the game because no. you don't have to kill them, you can yes. just watch. And it's not really logical of a series to just look to just make you look at sections where they are sneaking and then mm. snap and then throwing a bottle. And then <laughs> snap. And it's more about how the way people survived and the way different stages of love are being represented. Yeah. And I think if you would have shown a lot more infected, a scene like the ending of episode five would not have worked. The tension in that scene was real. Yeah, because, because the more was... you see them, the more you get accustomed to them. Yes. And then they are not scary anymore. And if you do it just a couple of times, that that's why the why I, I like that they teased the bloater in episode four and in five. <coughs> there, there he was, and he ripped the guy's head off, ripped Tommy because ripped that was Tom. Tommy from it the was games. Tommy's voice actor. Yes. So uh, yeah. Yeah. So I think the show made some changes, which is obvious and which is normal. But I think they did for the better. 
Yeah, I think so too. I I, I don't I won't complain. No. And I also think this is the episode where Ashley Johnson will be yeah. joining us, I guess, because I haven't seen her. No, this will be the episode. Uh, so we will see some origin story of Ellie, I guess, next to uh, Left Behind then. Yes, some things we haven't seen before. Maybe they're gonna fuck up this episode completely and maybe they will not even do the talked about ending of the game. We will see. <laughs> Let's watch the episode. Oh, that's Ashley Johnson. Ah, that's her. I wonder if she would bounce if she fell. You? <laughs> oh, no, she didn't. Never mind. But wait, wasn't Ellie immune because she got bitten during pregnancy? What? Isn't that why Ellie is immune? Who got bitten during pregnancy? She, the mother. The, there has or never been talked about Ellie's mother in any of the games. No, I think it was uh, some online or something. It was that an interview or could something. Could have been a rumor or something. I don't know. No, oh, that's the house of the game. Possibly. Oh, she sounds like Ellie from the games. Oh no, never mind. Oh, how should that come? How should that come? Really? <laughs> <laughs> it's locked. Oh, the water set. I think her back. water is broken. <laughs> I think so. Okay, yes. Ooh. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. oh Ellie, 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 Ellie. Ellie is in the belly. <laughs> Fuck her up. She, I think she gets bit in it. Stress is not good during pregnancy. What? She just came out. <laughs> what? <laughs> Sorry, that is funny. <laughs> Did she push the baby out while murdering an infected? Maybe the infected. <laughs> <laughs> You're so ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Just imagine that kid is infected now. <laughs> it's like a mandrake from Harry Potter. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But it looks the same. As a fucking mandrake. <laughs> I use those a lot in Hogwarts Legacy. <laughs> They're fucking OP, you know? Oh. Not now, now it doesn't look like a mandrig anymore, but... It's uh, look, it looks like a baby now. Yeah. Maybe this one. You never know. How did Kate Blanchett do it? <laughs> like this. <laughs> oh yeah! It's the last time we're gonna see this intro. It's the last of it. The last of you. Revelio. <laughs> I am beheaded. <laughs> no. found Ellie after left behind because Ellie was with But Fenra. Marlene put her in the QZ, remember? If, why would she put her with Fedra? Maybe she didn't. That's the catch. Yeah, but, but why? Tell me why. The last of us. She's still alive. Barely. Legs wide open with the skirt. <laughs> oh. Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> She's bitten. Told ya. <laughs> yeah, he didn't. <laughs> because her mother died. No, it was a fucking loud bang. <laughs> <laughs> the baby is not like, no! <laughs> <laughs>
all my mommies like ah, my ears! My ears do bleeding! Ah, you're so ugly! Ah. Oh, hi, Ellie. There she is. She remembered it. <laughs> no, she didn't. <laughs> Your guitar in that RV. It was all smashed up, but it got me thinking. Maybe I should find one. Find That's a great forever. In fact, I don't think you made me out to teach you. Poor girl. That's from the game. <laughs> hmm? That's from the game. Is it? I don't know. <laughs> I just remembered I said it a lot during the first episode. Off the, off the whole the ship with David, yeah, I think got, there uh, is just one level. That's in a no, tunnel, no, 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 a bridge no, no. kind of tunnel, yeah, something and there they, of course, where you fight three bloaters or something. Yes, and there they get injured then, or just no, exhausted. No, 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 no. And, they injured this before because that's how they get to David. Uh, no, I know something happens to them. So Fedra actually finds them, or no, the fireflies actually find fireflies, them. Fireflies, yes, and then they are also uh, already operating on uh, yes. Ellie when. Or going to operate on Ellie when they when Joel wakes up. Yes. Constantly uh, carrying ladders. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Making bridges from them. Yes. Or getting them up and down. And then dying. Otherwise, much would make her so happy. I don't know, but that's pretty high for a giraffe. Huh? Oh, yeah, maybe. it's a giraffe. Yeah. Oh, nice. Hello. <laughs> Hello, my name is Rav. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a G boy. <laughs> and a guy <laughs> skis right in front of them and is like, I'm a giraffe! <laughs> because he has a onesie of a giraffe. Nice. It's fucking weird, but it's really funny. You guys say Colorado! I'm a giraffe! Oh, I'm so happy to put it in. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> what a witch um, in the moment. Yeah. Did you know we have a hospital to go to? I'm gonna rides? ride a giraffe. <laughs> Let's go. I don't know exactly where this hospital is. Yeah, find it. Sure. It's just. You really want to do this? Maybe there's nothing bad out there, but so far there's always been something bad out there. Alright. Giraffe. What did you like most about the series? Giraffe. Giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> it has no donkeys in it, so <laughs> giraffe it is. <laughs> Where is Jenny? Eo. <laughs> Second day. It's nice well, how we can now talk yeah, about it. They were way better, so <laughs> than I was. It was me. I was the guy who shot and missed. Dude. <laughs> you literal piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, it was an earthquake down here. <laughs> the guy fought it and the coach was like, <laughs> Wait. Try to commit suicide. Mm -hmm. Okay, I did not see it. Uh, <laughs> you were busy. Fuck off! <laughs> you were busy talking about. No, not anymore. <laughs> Where is your brain going, dude? Yeah. Fuck now. Again. Shitty puns. <laughs> you better don't. <laughs> I was still thinking about the first one. No. Oh. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, shit. Nice reflexes, bro. Oh, those are the fireflies. <laughs> huh? Aren't they? I think so. <laughs> Oof. Good morning! 
Well, now I know why he fucking murders them. <laughs> you hit me in the head. Now I'll kill you all. <laughs> you hit me on the head. 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 Oh no, there is blood everywhere. It's Fedra. Oh no. Fireflies. Fireflies. I said that. Why are you stupid? <laughs> What will happen to the blowjers? Cordyceps grows inside the brain. Yep. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Cordyceps grows inside the brain. Does it? Find somewhere else. There is no yes. Else. Every. I thought it attacked everything, but the. But the. No, because every. Clicker is stage hmm. three, and then stage two, the runners you see the brains, uh, the yeah, yeah, yeah. forehead splitting open. It's wh wh where is your I brain? Know, I know, right? <laughs> I know, but I thought it was like no. That's the first thing it does. It's a fungus that takes over your brain. No, but I always thought that the people that were infected, maybe just in stage one and stage two, still are inside. In stage they, one, maybe, but, but they can't help it because the thing is controlling them. Maybe via their brain, maybe via their muscles. No, 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 no. It, it really takes them over. If you guys know it, please comment. Yeah. Once again, he doesn't believe me. No, I am just confused. <sighs> Marlene, you fucking bitch. You got it coming, mate. I don't want to be in debt to you, shoot him. <laughs> That's also an option. That's actually quite heartbreaking if you think about it. Well, thank you for spending half a year with her. Now fuck off. What the fuck are you doing? Keep walking. Shit, keep walking. <laughs> Fucks up everybody. Oh Jesus Christ, he's very stealthy about it. No, he is not. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. Oh. Please don't shoot him. Yeah, he will. Ooh, wow. Fucking love it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, take it. Oh, take it. Take it. Take it. Oh. Holy fuck! Pistol time! The way they handled this scene was fucking perfect. It's not dumb. <laughs> Pediatric oh. surgeon. I loved how the music was just sad. Take your time. I can see the elephant in the room. <laughs> More. <laughs> Can't. Like Kylo Ren said. More! <laughs> oh, there you are. <laughs> Surprised we didn't see Abby. She wasn't there. Yes, she was. Was she? Oh. Yeah, you haven't played the second game, though. <laughs> Apart. I know that that's her dad. How did you... <laughs> <laughs> so, so far, her dad. <laughs> I have to say, the way that the doctor died was not as uh, climactic as in the game. He was like, I won't let you take her. Oh! <laughs> I died. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's not a lot left in the game. No, there isn't. Can't keep her safe forever. Maybe. But it isn't for you to decide. Or you. So what she decide? Ah, just like the game. 
that actually they stopped looking for a cure. Raiders attacked the hospital and barely got you out of there. We'll find you some new ones on the way. Did see that coming? In the good Mortal Kombat fashion. Finish her! Flawless victory. You just come after her. Bullet in the brain. Back to Jackson. I literally wanted to say the same thing at the exact same moment. <laughs> but you did. <laughs> you were a millisecond before me. Tom is gonna be like, what is my fucking horse? Oh, it's like the opening from the second game. When you ride the horse, the horse. Tuk -tuk 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 -tuk. And the ending of the first game. No, not like that. Oh, God, it's like the exact same fucking location almost. There you go. Oh, I know for sure. Yeah, I did too. But I will give you the benefit of the doubt. struggled for a long time on survival, but no matter what, you keep finding something worth fighting for. That's not all me. Look, sometimes things don't work out the way we hope. You can feel like, like you come to an end. You don't know what to do next. But if you just keep going, you find something you need to fight for. You know, that's not the I swear to me that everything you said about the fireflies is true. I swear. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's the exact same. No, that pacing was really intense. God damn, it felt like we were like, really felt like we were just watching it, you know? Don't you think? I know, but I'm trying to ah there no yes. It's been 50 minutes, 50 minutes. Again, that was very fast. I did not see that coming. Uh, maybe a little too fast paced, I think, but still very fucking good. Especially the scene with Joel. When he went on his rampage, that was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. Yeah, I, but I think it's logical, it's fast. You, 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 I, I get what you mean though, because it was, like you said, the shortest episode of them all. Yeah, and it really felt like only, like only 15 minutes, maybe 20, maybe... So I don't know. It felt really fast. But yeah... Which is a good game. There wasn't... Yeah, good which game. is a good thing. <laughs> there, wasn't, there wasn't much more to tell and they just... No. Told the red. I think this episode is almost exactly like the game, except yeah. for the parts where you yeah you had to crawl around and sneak attack all those uh, fireflies. But I think for, it's it's almost exactly from the moment when they're in the hospital. It's almost exactly the same until the end. Yeah, I can see what you mean with that, and I like that too. Uh, just think it was maybe a little too fast paced for the rest of the season, but that's just a nitpick, but I... Very it's definitely good. faster, but yeah, yeah, they had to end the... Uh, yeah! I'm just thinking like, for an ending, it was like, okay, that's it. <laughs> yeah. But I really think the, the impact was still great. Joel going on his rampage, the choice for making that all just sad, to see how one of the soldiers with a bullet in his head just cried. And how Joel gave these last blows, that was phenomenally done. I keep saying that. That is my, maybe one of my favorite scenes of the entire season. For the rest, I think the entire ending was, felt like a little bit rushed on that part. Not but that's probably... focusing enough on why Joel made the choice. But again, that's something that we're going to see but... in season two and the second game. But that's, that's what I just said. It's exactly the same... Yes. As the game, it's the same pace, it's the same, yeah. uh, and it's the, the same moments, it's just you all, we've already seen the ending of the game, so... 
it, 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 it's, it's not new, so it won't. No. And the go. entire reason this felt a little bit rushed, maybe, is because, well, in the game, you're going to play it. it. It takes longer. Yeah, also that, but you already know what's going to happen, so it, it, will, it won't feel as long as it is supposed to uh, when you watch it for the first time. Yeah. So I think we also had this discussion before, but like even before the series started. Do you think Ellie already knows Joel is lying? At this point? I didn't know when when I played the first game, I didn't know if she if she knew it or if she she and she didn't want to believe it or if she, she mm. knew it and she wanted to believe it or she just believed him. Accepted it maybe? Yeah, or you just believed him. But I don't know. I, I like the ambiguity of it and for me I have always said there didn't have to be a part two. Uh, no. But I, I don't know. I, I, I've, I never would have said uh, I am sure that Ali believed Joel. Because in the second game and in the second season, what if they, if they make it? They um, it. Yeah, we will, we will see if, it's, if it will stay that way. But, uh, um, or are they going to focus on the second game? But the thing is, um, they they just ran with the idea that Ellie never uh, doubted Joel and that she always believed him, etc., etc. But which I always if find you, a little bit weird. If you look back at the face of Ellie in the game at the end, the thing that I associate the most with it is like, okay, I know you're lying, but I I'm, I'm willing to accept it and move on. Or I'm willing to accept it and try to yes. move on or whatever. And that's exactly what I got with Bella Ramsey in this episode. I think. I didn't think it was as good as the game, but yeah, in the game you can tweak it like however you want. So. I think her expression was still great. Again, some of the things she said a little fast. <laughs> but I've seen that with more things and I liked the style the series took. If you were to choose, do you prefer the game or the series? The game. The game, of course. But I do really like Pedro Pascal's incarnation yes, of Joel. I do very much. Uh, Ellie, I don't know. I, I, she was good enough for the series, but I don't know. She I, was she was acceptable. She was better than acceptable, but I didn't think she was great or, or mm -hmm. that good. Okay. If you know what I mean. Yeah. She was perfectly mediocre. I. I mm, because I think Bella Ramsey still has to develop more of her acting skills when she gets older. Because I don't know, I, she, I, I, I I'm too tired to, to make it very literate, but I don't think she gives off a lot of emotion when she tries to... Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I just always see that you said she expressed the face very good. I don't know. I always see the same face in her. I can see what you mean. I saw it in because her eyes. Because her eyes are always the same. I her saw, eyes are I always saw it in her eyes, which is crazy. Yeah, that's that, just that crazy. I do, that I do not understand because if, if you look at Pedro Pascal, his eyes are always nah, different. Was just perfect. If you look into his eyes, perfect. it's always different. And with her, it's always the same. But I can kind of agree on that, but I think it's also got to do with just opinion and interpretation of things. Could be different for some people. I mean, look at this. <laughs> could be. And I or you just could gotta be wrong, say, I'm right, <laughs> gotta <laughs> say, the thing you said about it, I can agree on. I was, I was on board with Pedro Pascal from the beginning. And uh, from the moment I saw him, and from the moment I saw him doing the thing with Sarah, loved it. Bella took me two, three episodes, but I think starting from episode four or five, then something clicked for me, and I thought, oh, okay, this is good. This is okay. Especially, especially in episode eight. I think her acting range in that episode, the last episode last week, was just phenomenal. She was, she was, she was the best really that fucking episode, good yes. in that and some other smaller moments like when Henry shot himself in the head her expression and her little scream that she did there was just a little thing yeah she has good moments I, I'm not saying that she's a terrible actress You're... no I think that's what you mean uh, but yeah I think that's those are the things that sold her for me and I think that's what made her for me in the end still a really good Ellie 
still kind of okay. still kind of doubting because they do a lot of growing up for the second game. I don't see that happening with Bella Ramsey. I think she's one of those actresses that's gonna look young for a very long time. It depends <laughs> on how long they will wait before they bring the second season to life. Uh, True. I'm just curious because on the way how they're gonna do that this because I don't also was three years in development, I think. No? Uh, yeah. But I just doubting from I know things from the second game, the things with Dina, the things with her and Dina having a baby. I, I don't see that with Bella Ramsey yet. So we're gonna see how that happens and what we're gonna do with it. Oh maybe big spoiler alert for if you haven't played the second game. Technically they don't have a baby together. Yeah, it's blah, 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 blah. all right. If you were to give a score for this series, not the episode the series, what would you give it? Eight. Seven and a half, eight. That's lower than I expected, gotta say. I think about going nine. Alright, thank you for your service. I won't give the game a ten out of ten because ten out of ten means perfect and there are also there are always things that can be better, so I would give the game a nine. So that's it. And I just said I think the game is better, so. And now, and now I'm gonna do something that people in 2023 don't do a lot of the times. I respect an opinion. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We will see about that. <laughs> <laughs> in the edit, I will fucking <laughs> break your ass. Uh, your oh. neck. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, guys, let me know in the comments down below what did you think of the episode? What did you think of the series? I'm very excited to hear your opinion on it. And I just want to thank you for watching this series. I want to thank you for staying with me in my troubled times of copyright and HBO being pity little fuckers. <laughs> A small thing I want to announce. Um, the Last of Us, the remastered PS5 version, is coming to PC at the end of this month. I have pre-ordered it and I will play it on this channel. So we're going to have a lot more uh, The Last of Us in coming. All right. Thank you for watching. And goodbye.